hi everyone today i am going to discuss about uh, creation of tables creation of multiple tables by using mysql so first i will open mysql command line client so here i have given a password as root so now we entered into the mysql so now i am going to create one database how can i create database what is the query for creating database in mysql means create create database database name okay now i have created a database so how can i see my database and uh, how can i see what are the databases available in this by using show databases for show databases so now what you created my test right so how can i go into uh, go to database how can i go to database so which i created just now so use use my test use my test so now i entered into my database my test so in this database i am going to create the tables going to create the tables i am taking road map example so here uh, we have entity diagram so this diagram represents number of entities and attributes relationship among the attributes so here we have entities like a reservation bus cancellation passenger and destination so reservation contains attributes like contact number status pnr number journey date address number of seats in the same way we have the number of properties for bus entity cancellation entity and passenger entity ticket entity see we have number of properties based on this i am going to create number of tables number of tables mm, first i am going to create passenger table so passenger contains what properties pnr number as ticket number name ppn go gender so how can i create a table create query query is create table table name is what passenger passenger so properties p n r number so that is int type next to should be primary key primary key means should be unique it doesn't allow null null value uh, null null value okay next to ticket number ticket number that is also int data type next to name name that is varchar varchar size we can allocate 20 30 next to age age also int okay next to gender 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 i am giving varchar 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 of 20 or 10 Ten and up. Okay. Next to P P ten. That is also that. That kind of that kind of something. Okay. See. <coughs> so I have to 
close right now enter enter so what table we have created passenger table we have created now how can i see the table what you have created just now so what are the properties the table contains that we can see by using this query describe describe table name is what passenger passenger that's it see we can see uh, into default value uh, 11 and uh, pn number uh, not allowing null values so pn number primary key okay see in that way we are going to create we are going to create tables see now passenger table uh, completed now store reservation so i am going to create a reservation reservation table what query is what create table reservation create table reservation pnr number that is what int write int type next to number of seats number of seats number of seats that is also int int comma address address where care of 40 ok next to contact number contact number so that is what int, int. next to status 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 where care of ten I have here. Okay. Now I created reservation table also. How can I see the table? So describe, 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 describe table name. Reservation, reservation. See. Next to <coughs> next to bus table I have to create. Create table bus that contains bus number comma bus number means that is what type? Where there I can you write? It will allow both uh, integer values and string values, right? So next to bus number that should be that should be primary key. okay primary key next uh, source 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 and destination source where care of where care of turn comma this destination destination where care of 20 right now now what happened bus table also created describe bus ok next next what table I am creating cancellation table create table create table cancellation 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 that contains pnr number that is uh, int comma number of seats number of seats that 
it is also int is to address address var char of twenty comma contact contact number so <coughs> int next status status var char of ten okay now what happen translation table also created describe cancellation c cancellation table also created next ticket table p i create what is the query create table create table ticket create table ticket so what properties ticket number ticket number that is int comma should be primary key primary key okay next age age int comma gender gender var char of var char of var char of gender 10 okay that should not be null so not null okay next source var char of 10 next destination 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 var char of 20 next department sorry departure type dp time var char of 20 what is okay now ticket table also create describe yes okay ticket ticket okay now you have seen right so in this way we can create the tables so total i have created how many tables passenger ticket cancellation bus and reservation total five five tables i have created so the next session i will show how to alter the columns by using alter query okay then we will see the insertion deletion all ddl and dml queries okay